Yeah, what up? Welcome back to the video, guys. We are back with another La Para seat. If you have been following me for some time now, you know I got the La Para kickflip for my 2020 low rider rest. Then I went ahead and got the La Para tail whip for my 21 roll glide. And now we got another La Para for my 1983 FXR. So I haven't opened this up yet, as you can see, still taped up and everything so kind of want to give you guys the whole organic feel of opening the box and me viewing the seat because i haven't seen it yet uh so huge shout out to lapara first of all huge huge shout out to lapara for once again working with me on another amazing seat shout out to dante real solid dude um we worked on this together he came up with an idea i came up with some other ideas we threw it in there and I, I'm eager to see it. I haven't seen it. I, I didn't even see a sketch. I didn't see a picture. He didn't send me anything. So uh, you're going to be seeing this at the same time that I'm seeing this right now. Let's just open this up. Now, if you guys seen the seat that I got on my FXR right now, it's not the pretty seat. It's pretty wild, uh, but it's too bulky and not, 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 not my style, uh, but it's, it's pretty, pretty wild. Um, this seat, just a heads up, it's, it's also wild. It's just a nicer seat. Uh, different design seat and but it's it's, it's pretty wild. wild she loved to do the wild thing. This is wild. This is pretty wild. Ah, uh, I love the fresh smell of new. So when I say wild, this is wild. So we got some flames coming up right here. The seat that's on the FXR right now also has flames and I don't know, I, I kind of like the retro flame look. I think it's pretty cool. Um, so I, I kind of wanted to keep that, the, the, the flame theme in the back. Now, the, the bike is birch, white, and black. So kind of went ahead with that off-white color here as well. Everything else blacked out. Um, we got two different textures on here. So we got that gripper for the seat. Um, I have this gripper material on the uh, tail whip and, and it's amazing. Um, it definitely keeps you in place. It doesn't let you move around. Um, it, it's, it's the grip on it. It's really, really good. And it's just, and it's not something that's like, you know, too rough. It's just like perfect. So we got that gripper seat right here. We got that, that nice leather, smooth, 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 like butter leather going up right here as well. We got the Lapara logo right there, as you can see in gold. Um, and yeah, man, it's just, this is dope. This, this is, I, I want to throw this on right now and, uh, just finish, um, I, I just want to see it on the bike. Ta-da! So here we have it. What do you guys think? Leave your thoughts and your comments down below. I think it's pretty wild. I think it's pretty sick. Um, I was honestly expecting the fire 
Like, the fire's fine. I just, this is a little weird to me here. I don't know what it is. But it looks cool and it looks different. And I like it. So you got a bit of that gripper material right here on the top as well going through there. And then just the, uh, the black stitching on the flames going through the back, which looks absolutely sick, man. And it's just this, this gripper material, man. I'll just, I'll sit on it right now. It, it really keeps you right in place. So especially for you guys who like to get real aggressive in the canyons and everything, if you want to get this material on another seat, um, it, it's really good. I, I, I really like it. It just ah, it feels so good. Um, you're gonna have that off-white stitching right here in the bottom as well where the seat is at. It just makes everything pop out. I do like the design of this right here, uh, the pattern of the stitching. And it's just, ah, that 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 leather smell, that, that new leather smell, man. Oh, amazing. What do you guys think? I think it, it, it definitely changed the whole look of the bike big time. Um, yeah, that other seat I had was, ugh, ugh. ugh. I did like the fire in it though. Um, this is an old school FXRC, so flips over just like that. Um, I did keep the hardware that was on the uh, on that seat. That's the, the stock hardware. Um, so I took that off of it, put it on this one. So you pull the tab right here, seats flip over, and then you have access to your battery and everything else. Um, yeah, man, uh, absolutely love it. Um, once again, huge, huge shout out to LaPara for working with me. Once again, uh, great quality stuff. I'm not saying it just because we got to work on the seat together, but you know, LaPara is, is known in history for the good quality stuff. And the great longevity of the company speaks for itself. So um, great stuff. Always, 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 always tell people to get LaPara's. Really comfortable. Um, I do want to put some miles on this. So before, you know, we start, uh, reviewing how the seat is and everything then you know we'll do that um i will follow up with um my first ride review type of thing to see how it feels first off on the road um so later on this week we'll get some time get on the bike uh catch a few little miles and i'll let you guys know everything else um i i absolutely love this thing man looks sick little by little i'm, I'm making this bike like my own start out with the seat right now uh doing a, a whole bunch of things to this bike, so tune in for that. Anyways, that's gonna be it. If you wanna keep watching more FXR content, if you wanna keep watching low rider S content and roguelike content, there's a ton of stuff coming little by little. You're definitely in the right place. Tune in, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell button. That's gonna notify you anytime I upload any type of new content. And uh, that's it. Like always, let the force be with you. Ride safe and enjoy the ride, baby. Peace.